our power tools. <laughs> 1974's The Texas Chainsaw Massacre has remained one of the best horror franchises of all times. The story of these hapless teenagers who wander into a world that is full of horrors has definitely made its mark. Throughout this original film, we watched Leatherface and his brood torture these hapless kids, and it was glorious. Yours truly decided to take a trip down to Texas and see why has this franchise remained one of the most gruesomely awesome in history. Won't you join me? All right, here we are. This is the world famous gas station, and this is a great place to find horror gifts for you and yours. Let's take a look around and see what we got. Now everything we have here is absolutely killer. We're looking at t-shirts galore. If you're a fan of Texas Chainsaw Massacre, you couldn't find a better selection of t-shirts. I mean, everything here is just absolutely killer. We also have prints that they have, all available for sale. Everything looks really, really cool, and they're autographed, which you cannot beat. Not everything here is just Texas Chainsaw Massacre. You can have all kinds of slasher greats filling your office or your home. You can't go wrong with all these creations. Yes, yours truly was truly enjoying all the glory that he found here at the wonderful gas station. All kinds of amazing things I found for the pirate office, and quite honestly, yeah, I could not resist. There's a couple things I brought home with me. That's right, let's get our grub on, shall we? So here at the world-famous gas station, where they film Texas Chainsaw Massacre, not only can you enjoy all the sights, but you can also have a very tasty meal. That's right, they have their own barbecue right here. Just waiting for you. Mmm, and damn tasty. Just imagine who this was. Amazing. It looks just like the van from the movie. I mean, seriously, this is really creepy to see this van. But we're not done yet, because if you're gonna stay here, you might as well stay overnight. That's right, there's a B&B &B in the back. And let me tell you, if you're willing to stay here overnight, you are one brave soul. I hope you survive. <laughs> You know, come down to Bastrop, Texas if you can, and if you can, stay here at the world-famous gas station. Have a bite to eat at the barbecue uh, location in front there, and stay at the B&B, &B, because I'll tell you something, it's like something you've never seen before. While you're here, get comfortable, relax, and maybe watch something good out of their DVD collection, like this. That's just the first stop on this great tour. Let's see what else we have. Oh, it's time for some kolaches.
That's right, if you're out here in West Texas, there's no better place to get some good kolaches but the check stop. Stop by, have a bite. No kidding, these are actually very, very tasty. I am quite the fan. So just FYI, if you're in the neighborhood, check out the check stop. You're not going to be sorry. But next on our tour, we have the great adventure of touring the murder house of Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Yeah, it's a little different than it was back in the day, but I think you're going to enjoy. Let's check it out. Every great serial killer slasher has to live somewhere. And in this particular situation, this house was the house that Leatherface lived. That's right, this next great adventure takes us to the house where Leatherface and his brood lived. And, uh, oh, it's going to get quite messy. Well, here we are. This is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre murder house. I mean, it's a cafe now, and it's got a bar and everything, but this is the same exact house. It was moved all the way out here to Kingsland, and this is where they actually filmed Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So this Victorian home was taken piece by piece and put here in this beautiful area. It's very nice, and they've made it, as you can see, much prettier than when it was a murder house. It's a lot of fun, a good time. So come and check it out. And here we are in the actual house that was the Texas Chainsaw Massacre murder house. This is very cool. This is the upstairs area that I'm at where it has a lot of classic pictures. But no kidding, this is actually the house that they had the movie in. And the cool thing about it, this is the upstairs area where grandma and grandpa were and were murdered. So this is really cool. I love being here, this is fantastic. This is gonna round out my trip here in Texas this time around. And it's so cool. Oh my God, look at the history here. I mean, this is the actual house right here that I'm at. Go up the stairs. This is where all of this actually happened. So, anyhow, this is me, Gio Braun, saying until next time, stay killer. Mr. Sunshine